Hey y'all, I'm going to show you how to set up your folder structure for 2024 so your images will always be imported into dated and chronological folders. I do this every year. Uh, this is the last day of the year. It's 629 on December 31st, 2023. And obviously I want these folders available to me for next year, which is to say tomorrow. So I'm going to come back out here just to show you what I already have. So this is my working drive right here. So it says six terabyte working drive. And I just want to note too, I have photos, photos, I have photos and more photos down here. So this is my working drive and this is my backup drive. It's really important to have a backup drive. If you're a photographer, whether you're a hobbyist or a working photographer, having backups is critical. You will for sure at some point have a hard drive crash and you don't want to be left with not having access to all the beautiful work you've made. So I'll go into my working drive here and I'll show you what my folder structure looks like. So I have uh, these folders set up from 2010 until this year and this is what my 2023 looks like and I'm going to recreate this entire structure for next year. So just some things to note. It's important to start with the year and then month and that will cause these to order themselves chronologically. If you start with month and then the, the year, they'll be all over the place. So just start with the year. And then for these folders, these are, these are folders that I use for my own work. And then these here are folders that I have set up for work that I do for you know myself, like work that I get um, paid for. So events, whatever, whatever. So this is exactly the structure that I'm gonna recreate. So I'm gonna set this over here because I want to have this um, I want to be able to refer to this so you won't be able to see this for a sec so just hold tight and I'm going to come down here into my folders and I'm going to open file explorer this gives me a new window and I'm going to come back into my working drive and open that up and I'm going to just go new so in your top left hand corner and this is Mac and PC you'll find somewhere to have new click on that I want a folder and I'm going to call this 2024 photos. Simple. And then I'm going to open this up and I'm just going to start recreating all of these folders, this folder structure. So right away, and it's a bit of a process because every time you do this, you have to create, you have to click new. So my first one is going to be 2024. Uh, oh, this is going to take me a minute like everybody else to remember that that's what's happening. Click new again, folder, and you're just going to repeat this until you have all of your folders ready to go for the next year. So I'll stop here just for a sec, just because this will make sense. Uh, and then I'll come down here and click new, new folder, and then I'm going to do 2023, 2024. <laughs> Uh, events okay so that's basically how you set that up so you'll you'll do it for whatever makes sense for you I really do suggest having the 24-01 all the way down to 24-12 uh, and then 2024 and then folders that contain specific things so if you do studio work or if you do landscape work and for money this is how I do it I just designate it for stuff that I'm paid for and stuff that I do for me so once you're done all of that you can s click and select all of these folders and go control or command copy or you just go back out one step and you can see 2024 photos right here so all i'm going to do is i'm going to right uh, sorry uh, right click yes i am going to right click and i'm just all i want to do is copy this whole folder here Okay, so here's a uh, copy right here in my system. You, if you're on a Mac, it'll look a little bit different, but all you want to do is just copy this. And then I'm going to navigate back to my PC and I'm going to go to my photos and photos and more photos. And then all I'm going to do is right click again and then paste it. And you'll see it turns up at the bottom, but whenever you re refresh this, it'll, I'll just back out for a second and then come back in here. And you'll see now that 2024 photos is there and inside that, are all the folders that you've created. So that's the quick and dirty way to do it. Go to your working drive, create all the folders that you need for the coming year, then go back out to the containing folder, which is 2024 photos, copy that into that folder and paste that into your backup drive and you'll have everything that you've made inside that folder copy over to your backup drive. 
If you need help with this, you can always email me. Uh, my email is info at julievincentphotography.com. Talk to you soon.